Welcome users. First of all, wish you all happy new year 2025. This session covers Dr. S. R. Ranganathan's colon classification, sixth edition, main class literature, in specific the work facet, the work facet related concepts and how to structure the notations for various author works. Ranganathan has identified four levels of personality facet in the main class literature. You are observing the four levels of personality facet P1, P2, P3 and P4. Personality facet is one of the fundamental categories you are all aware of it. Before understanding the categories, you need to familiar with the concept postulate of rounds and levels, because Ranganathan has applied the four levels in one round in the main class literature. So, the personality facet round 1, level 1, personality facet round 1, level 2, personality facet round 1, level 3, personality facet round 1 and level 4. These are the various levels identified in the main class literature. Of the four levels, the P4 level is the main focus of this lecture. Let me explain one by one. So, the P1 facet exclusively discuss about the language facets. P2 is related to form facet, P3 discusses about author facet, the P4 covers the work facet. When you classify the documents which are related to the literature, these four levels need to be identified. The class number should be constructed with the four levels. You can't ignore any one of the levels, particularly for the literature related subject. So, the first facet language facet. Just I give you recollect the concept of the language facet. The language facet should be viewed as focusing on the language, the literature to which the book blanks or the literature that the book discusses. The term language inequality must be recollected here. What is language inequality? Language of work is not equal to language of book. Keep it in your mind. Language of work is different, language of book is different. In the CC 6th edition schedule, you can find the main class literature under the chapter O. You are watching on the screen. The highlighted part shows the personality facet around 1 level 1. See P1, the 1 is not indicated here, but it is assumed it is the round 1 level 1 category. So, do not get confused. If the 1 is not exist, it means it is the level 1 category. The next one is the P2 and P3, P4, these are all the various levels of the main class literature. So, the first uh, level is indicated here. Here Ranganathan has provided the instructions. So, you must approach the chapter language division to get the notations for the language. See, this is the language isolate provided under the chapter 5. The sample page, the first page is displayed here for your understanding purpose. You can find various notations for different languages. Each and every language is clearly identified by the unique notational system. 
So whatever the language of your document which you are going to classify in your library, just you can get the language number here. The next facet, form facet. P2 covers the form facet. In the form facet, the emphasis should be on the type of literature that the book discusses or contains. The form inequality must be recollected here. Form of work is not equal to form of book. Keep this in your mind. The difference you need to observe carefully. Let me show the form facet in the main class literature. The highlighted report shows the P2 facet. Here you can find various forms. It has been categorized from 1 to 7. Poetry, drama, fictions, letters, oration, etc. So you can find the notations for the form facet here. P3 covers the author facet. The author of the literary piece or work that the book contains, discusses or treats should be the main focus of the author facet. So recollect the author inequality. What is author inequality? Author of work is not equal to author of book. So you need to carefully understand the difference between author of work and author of book. There is always difference exists. Understand? Let me show the author facet in the schedule. You are watching the author facet P3, focus in P3. This part covers the author date of birth. So the date and the year related details can be collected from the time isolate chapter. So the chronological division chapter is provided in the schedule. If you visit the chronological division under the chapter 3, you can find the time isolates for all periods. This is three digit format. Actually, the three digit format needs to be identified. It is the rule. Do not forget. As per the rule, three digits are permitted. The century, decade and the year. These are all the areas mainly we need to focus on the time isolate part. the level 4, the work facet. The work that the book contains or discusses should be the main focus of the work facet. Work is not equal to book. Do not forget, work is not equal to book. This is termed as work inequality. The work facet is provided in the schedule under the personality facet level 4 focus in P4, in the bottom area it is highlighted. Here Ranganathan has provided the instruction. See rules in chapter O of part 1. That means there is no enumerated numbers are available in the schedule for the P4 part. Ranganathan has provided the rules. With the help of this rule, anyone can structure the notations for the work facet. The author's work number should be collected and calculated based on the rule provided under the phase at P4. So no ready-made numbers available. So nowadays many classifiers and the learners, they are using the techniques rendered by Sir Ranganathan to calculate the notations. And in an alternative, Ranganathan has provided to uh, go for alphabetical device. Author name can be used with the help of the alphabetical device. But the alphabetical device will not help you to identify the work number. So because of the complications to calculate the notations, many classifiers are using the alphabetical device. Let me show the various range of works provided by Sir Ranganathan to calculate the work numbers. Under the work phase, Ranganathan has given these ranges. The first range covers works 1 to 8. Number of works of an author should not exceed 8. 
this is the first range. In the second range, the number of works are greater than 8 and should not exceed 64. In the third range, number of works of an author is greater than 64 but does not exceed 512. So, these are the three ranges have been provided by the Ranganathan in the schedule. So, from the up one, 1 to uh, 512 works, we can calculate the number. But be, with the help of the rules, we can extend this device because nowadays you can see more authors have contributed more than 1500 works in the literature. In our state, in Tamil Nadu, many authors are there who are having more than 1500 works in their credit. Hence, I have extended the device from 512 to 4096. So, in this range, we can add more numbers. With the help of the rules, we can extend the device. Number of works of an author is greater than 512, but does not exceed 4096. The numbers which I have constructed is available in the journal article format. It is an open access journal. So, you can find it here. See, this is the website. If you access this website, you can find the article. You can uh, freely download it. The notations for the literature documents is very easy with the help of this notations because everything is enumerated by me. So, in this article you can find more than 1700 and works and the related notations have been also provided. The same numbered systems have been developed in an application format which I also have used to teach this literature in the classroom. You are watching the related shorts uh, which is available in our educational multimedia center website. If you access the university website, you can find the lot of contents related to colon classification which was lectured by me. So, this one is related to the application. See all the ranges I have provided here. This is the one actually I have extended greater than 512 to 4096. You can get the work number for the thousand work. Authors, thousandth work will get the number 2858. So, as per your is whatever the author work, if you enter the work number, this application will give you the notation. If the work is uh, simplified. You need not use any techniques to calculate the number, it is readily available. As I said, when you classify the literature documents using the notations with the help of the rules is one way and identifying the alphabetical device is an another way. But with the help of this article and the application, you can go for notations for the literature related works. Many contents are available in the website, you can find it here. They have made available the maximum colon classification related documents and the samples you can find out here. Use them for your practice.
hope this may help you but as i said before start to practice the literature related documents classification the rounds and levels related concept you must be aware of it so learn it thoroughly you can consult your course teacher regarding the notations of the work phase set or an application you can contact me for further clarification hope this may help you wish you all the best